Hey everybody, Healthy Prepper here with some ideas for using dental floss in the prepper world. Um, I've got some different kinds of floss here and uh, I just thought I'd go over some tips uh, specifically for preppers that might come in handy someday in any apocalyptic pinch. So the first one is uh, it can be used as a substitute thread to sew together sheets, blankets, or tarps for shelter. Um, It'd be ideal if you had a large darning needle or a uh, plastic sock needle, uh, sewing needle. Um, you could keep this in your bug out bag um, to make shelter uh, if you're on the move, on the run, um, anything like that. Number two would be uh, you can make a crude rope out of dental floss. You may need to braid it together, but the tensile strength of dental floss is uh, incredible so when you braid it you uh, multiply it many times so it can be used for uh, small rope needs uh, for example you need to hang your food from bears because you're bugging out and you have erected your little tent like device but you don't want to keep your food right with you in there just in case of animal attack um, number three is mesh repair for screens play pens animal pens and the like uh, this is great, let's say if you're in a, in a mosquito infested area and you have some mosquito netting and there's a hole in it, this uh, would be great to do some repair on that. Also, um, it's a, an excellent replacement for um, in an emergency situation for a saw or a knife for obviously small um, semi-hard substances like bread, cheese, fruit, etc. If you tie um, two hard items to either end of the uh, dental floss and you wrap it around each item like let's say you have a, a bolt here and a bolt here and you wrap it around the threads and you have the string in between the two bolts you can use it to saw back and forth or cut through um, food items or other things that you might come across that need cutting if you have nothing else. Uh, the next one is uh, emergency fishing line. Because of the strength you'd be able to catch some good small to medium sized fish if um, uh, you, you can use this as fishing line. You double it up if need be if the fish might be bigger but in a pinch it's great to have. Uh, the next thing would be clothesline. Let's say you're bugging out again or for some reason the power is out at home and you can't use your dryer. You can um, double or triple it and, or braid it and you can use it as um, uh, a clothesline to hang your clothes on to dry um, and that might be a good little tip. The next one is um, it could be a garden aid. Uh, let's say you're prepping away and you're uh, planting your garden, your tomatoes, and they start hanging. Well, you can use dental floss to help suspend the vines as they grow. The taller vines, as they start to get more weight on them, they tend to fall over. So you can actually use the uh, dental floss to help support them. You can tie them. Um, to a tree or to put a stake in the ground, another stake on the other side and help us uh, suspend or support the vines that way. Next would be you can help seal leaky pipes. You can almost use it in place of a Teflon tape around the threads of a pipe that may be leaking. Um, I also heard of how you can use this if you have a leaky faucet in the bathroom and if it's leaking around the threaded cap that goes on the end of the faucet you can unscrew the cap and wind dental floss around there, um, even wax dental floss will work, and then screw the thing back on and hopefully the leak will stop if that's the problem. Um, let's see. Oh, a, uh, here's a good one. An emergency shoe or boot lace. So uh, you're you know, bugging out and away you're off or you're working out in the field somewhere trying to prep away, uh, maybe working in the garden and goes the shoelace. Uh, it goes, it snaps on you and you've got your handy dandy dental floss in your bug out bag. So you are uh, ready to go. Keep, keep on trucking. <laughs> okay, um, the next one is fishing net. Now this may take a little bit more skill, but in an apocalyptic pinch scenario where food is going to be a hot commodity, you can actually uh, weave a, a primitive fishing net out of, of um, dental floss and it will carry the weight of small to medium sized fish and you can also use this to um, catch bait fish as well so you can catch bigger fish. Uh, so another good use to have this. Another thing is um, fire starter material. Uh, the waxed kind will actually burn very nicely to give you um, those few precious moments 
to get your fire started. So you can ignite this and then put your you know, shavings or kindling and things like that and then slowly build your fire. And uh, the last one, um, now this would be in a very primitive situation, but you can actually use this for stitch material. If somebody gets a severe cut in the wilderness, the outdoors, there's no help around, and you gotta get that gash together so the person can you know, transport themselves possibly. Um, you, if you have a needle, you can sew a big gash together. It won't be sterile. It's not going to be pretty. It's not going to be perfect. And it's going to hurt like heck without any anesthesia, of course. But um, you can stop bleeding by doing this. So you're actually tamponading or tightening um, the gash, therefore closing any blood vessels that are in there too. So you're buying the person some time. Obviously, you need to get them to a place where they're going to be administered antibiotics and uh, uh, the like. So in a, an emergency pinch, think of this, you do have this. Oh, and I don't think I said this one, but this is a really good one. Um, if you ever, if it ever comes to pass, you're in an emergency situation and a baby is delivered, you can tie off an umbilical cord with dental floss. Yes, it works very nicely and it will work in a pinch. And of course, you need to follow up with the proper medical care afterwards as quickly as possible. But never a bad idea to have a little dental floss in your bug out bag, in your um, car glove box, and uh, around the house. So, and actually, uh, right now there are some coupons, if you're a couponing prepper like I am, um, for Reach Dental Floss. And you can get this at the Dollar Tree right now, so um, I think it's free. Or it might be a, a dollar off of two, and, you, and so it's for 50 cents or something like that. But there's a coupon out there right now, so if you want to stock up, now it's time to stockpile on some dental floss, folks. Happy and healthy prepping. Signing out.